So in terms of the musicality, we can develop a rhythmic dance, which is based around the slows and quick, quick, slow structure. But we can also take more time and do more lyrical elements and slow things down. And a lot of times in the music, if there's a singer or some lyrical thing in the music, it really lends itself nicely to slowing it down. So we'll show you a few pausing steps in these next sections. First one we can do is just off a side step, taking a big side step. Here I'm going to bring my feet together. I'm going to give her a little bit of a pivot to the left and then a little bit of a pivot to the right. And when I do that, I'm turning my whole body around her. That gives her the pivot. Now I'm going to lead her to take a little step through forward. And then I just change weight onto my right foot and we're done. From here, I could do a, a left check step. Again, a big side step. I could do another pausing step. So I give her a pivot and a second pivot. And now I'm going to open up this left side of my embrace that leads her to take a small step through. And then I pivot her so that she faces me and I have my left foot free and we can take off. So there's a lot of little pivoting. Again, there's one pivot for her here, second pivot here. Now I have to lead her to take a step through, so I'm going to open up the left side of my body. And after that step, I need to pivot her so she's facing me again. So there's a lot of little subtleties there in order to make it comfortable for the follower. You know? For the followers, you can see what Jenna's doing. On the first pivot, there might be a little bit of a sweep out of the foot, a little low baleo. When we pivot to the front, you can tuck in front, tuck the foot in front as a little embellishment. And then as you step through, the foot can tuck behind, and then you're ready to go here. There's lots of different little ways you can use to interpret that, but I think the biggest thing for the followers is not to rush that, and same for the leaders, to afford a lot of time for both of us. That we're not trying to do this in a rhythmic sense, we're trying to do it really slowly. We can also exit it with another side step and we can repeat it. Even if the music is rhythmic, like at this point in the, what's happening in the music, we can still do these lyrical elements, these pausing steps, and it's still considered a musical, nice way of interpreting the tango.